Yo there guys, what is happening? Welcome back to another video here on National Vlogs. Today we're doing another reaction video. Today we are reacting to some of my old videos again, but we're reacting to my most popular videos. So this is going to be interesting. As for normal, we're going to watch three videos and I'm going to give you some behind the scenes facts and secrets about each video. So sit back. Let's get straight in with my most popular video, which is a message from Ben Phillips. This has 49 likes, 634 views. I knew it was going to get a lot of views, but I didn't think that much. Funny story about this was this was uh, VidCon 2019. Now, at the time, I couldn't get down there because I had just moved house and I didn't have the money. So, one of my vlog stars, Zach from Theme Park Extreme, go check out his channel, really good content, um, was there anyway, and he said Ben, he was going to meet Ben Phillips. I asked him, could he get a video of Ben Phillips saying subscribe to Nash of Vlogs, in an attempt to get more subscribers. <coughs> yeah, didn't work, did it? It didn't really work. But here's the video anyway. I love that Ben did this. People ask me afterwards, did I pay for this video to get made? And I'm like, <laughs> nope. Yo, guys, what's going on? Make sure to subscribe to Nash Vlogs right now. Like this video, turn the notification on, comment below. Subscribe to Ben Phillips. <laughs> That's typical of Ben Phillips, though. Um, it's a little cringy. Why did I get it done? But I got a shitload of views, so, ha! I'm thinking, oh, fucking hell, that makes me sound like a views whore. Oh, my God. All right, so the next video we're gonna watch, we'll watch four in this video actually, because that one was a short one. The next vlog, now we've already reacted to uh, the Basis Dope Fun Park vlog. We did that in my first reacting to my old videos. Go watch that, link in the card somewhere here. I'm gonna react to my next one, which is the Walking Dead Living Nightmare Extreme Preview event. Alright, so this one was uploaded on May 20th, literally the night after it, it happened, I think. And this is what the stats are. So it has eight likes and three dislikes. How can you dislike a preview event vlog? How? Um, it has 468 views. That's actually quite good. That's quite good. Anyway, let's go. This I was using... Um, I was using, what camera was I using? It wasn't a GoPro. I don't think it was a GoPro Hero 5. It might have been, it might have been. Yo yeah, guys, I'm going to go look for today. I'm here at Fort Park Resort today. I've got exclusive access to the Walking Dead the Nightmare Extreme Maze. This is how you can tell why I don't vlog as much anymore. Because I get so nervous. There's people looking at me, and that's why I hide the camera so much. Uh, I think it's just anxiety sort of thing. I just looked at the entrance, where, and the entrance looks really good. I'm looking forward to going in there. See you with the camera. Yeah, uh, that night I got to meet Jack Silkstone and all that lot for the first time. Friends with them ever since. So, yeah. Shout out to Jack Silkstone. So, all right. Go check out his content. His content is insane and he deserves every single subscriber that he gets or already has. Yeah. So, yeah. There's Colossus. Let's have a look at Logan Lee. Oh, try back to when Log of Glee was a Greek freak massacre. Damn. Look bad. Damn. Looks like Logos ain't gonna come back. Called it! <laughs> called it. I called it. Those who said that I were lying that Log of Glee would have come back. I called it, motherfuckers. I called it. No, it's 30 years old. Yeah. We're going to go 
score did a really good soundtrack for that attraction for the queue line and shit and it was pretty sick um just to let you know how long i waited for that attraction, i waited about an hour and a half i think and we got told it was about 40 minutes but it was the first time running the groups so it was a bit of a um you know trial <laughs> Oh, yeah, so the same. Okay. I have a feeling the route's the same. I'll let you know then. The route was the same, always has been. Now heading in, guys, to the new video if you want to know. Stream here. Oh my god. I'm looking forward to that. That tunnel in 2017 Fright Nights wasn't as dark. And going in there in 2018, it was a hell of a lot darker, so it was weird. It was weird going into that tunnel again. Yeah, we'll see So guys, that's how I was watching Dead Living on X3. Really good, really good. Lot more. I loved Living on X3. I did. I only got to do it, uh, I think, twice. But I loved it. It was absolutely brilliant. You know, shame when that... Hopefully they might do something like this again at four somewhere in the future. Maybe not for a few years following on from um, social distancing, but yeah. Back to So we've just done Living Nightmare. We're going to go on to the other Walking Dead attraction now. And we'll see you when we come off. Right, don't get me wrong. I like Walking Dead the ride. But I don't know how long... The contract is. I've heard it's till 2022. I think I might be wrong on that. I don't know. But don't get me wrong. Loads of people say the Walking Dead ride is crap. It's not. It's not crap. When there's actors in there, it's a pretty good attraction. But when actors aren't in there, it. I just love the theming in there. I genuinely, you know, it adds the experience of you're walk, running away from the walkers and everything's going on. Nemi Inferno, my favourite, one of my favourite coasters of four. Still not as good as four. It was a 15 or a 25. 15, maybe a 25. I ended up waiting about 20 to 30 minutes in the station. I haven't got much footage though, so. It was an annual pass yeah. night though, so it was quite busy. So guys, we're now going to go on our probably the last ride, which is going to be Zodiac. I like Zodiac. Don't get me wrong, I enjoy Zodiac. Zodiac's fun. Why did I put a random picture of Platform 15 in there? Thank you very much everyone for watching this vlog. Like, comment and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. But yeah, as you can see, that was before I started doing funfair vlogs, and I was very not confident. Watch, all right, okay. This is, we might. This might be the last one we watch. We're gonna watch the Legoland Windsor Brick or Treat vlog. This was a mini road trip that me, Life of Dills, and Theme Park Extreme did in October 2018. It was one of the best three days of my life. It was brilliant. And this was the Hello. This is the first time I've ever done Legoland Windsor as well. This was my first ever trip to Legoland Windsor. So I was excited because I know good things. Right, let's go. Hello guys, welcome to another vlog here with Dash Vlogs. Today we are here at Legoland Windsor. We were given, we were sat. I point at Zach and I'm pointing at a kid. But nah, nah, it was a good day, that. It was a really good day. No. Um, the 
the camera I was using in this video, Zach lent me his camera to use for that video. So that was filmed on a Canon G7X, and I really want to buy a Canon G7X eventually because I think it's a brilliant camera. And yeah, we've had the new squid suppers. First part of the afternoon. Rides over until 8 p.m. I had a really sore throat during this video, so I'm trying to shout into the camera over the people behind me. And you can hear me go, ah, ah, like that. It's That's why I try not to film vlogs when I'm ill. Well, it works at seven. Uh, the Pirates of Skeletal Bay show is over there. We'll get some shots of that later on. I love the stunt show there. It's brilliant. I'm sure that'll be very good. Yeah. Um, right. Oh, typical. Bitch. Let's go on Squid Surfers. Ready? Let's do it. Squid Surfers was mad. It's one of my favourite rides at Legoland. I love doing Squid Surfers. It's fun. It's fun. So, just come off Squid Surfers. That was actually fun. That was lit. We were on the same one. We were going so We basically pulled it in and we skid it out. It was so good. Dylan was in control of the thing we were on. The, like, the, um, like, what are they? Jet ski sort of thing? Dylan was in charge of the one we were on, which was absolutely hilarious. I think it was one of the best ride experiences I've ever had. So, I'll do it to Fancy, please. <laughs> Zach made a joke about uh, maybe one of them coming to Fort for 2020. Didn't happen, no, did it? We're not going to get a water ride to replace um, loggers. Can't say it out. You know what? Um, bye bye. Bye bye. But no, Squid Zombies was lit. Quite a long cycle, so um, yeah, don't know what the next ride is, Zach knows. Uh, Atlantis Submarine Team. Atlantis. We'll see you. Journey we into Atlantis. We'll see you when we get to Atlantis. We never did it, Atlantis in the end, which is a shame. But it's just uh, been redone to Lego Sea Deep Sea Adventure, I think it was. So, so when the parks reopen, I'm going to make a trip down there. The view we got at the stunt show was brilliant because there's a restaurant behind the lighthouse, so we were just watching it from there. We got a brilliant view, absolutely brilliant view. Well, pretty much me and Dylan just decided to go into the Lego Friends shop and piss about with the mirror. It was funny. It was really funny. To Mia's riding school. Yeah, Mia's riding school, adventure, thing, the <laughs> That thing. Um, yeah, we're gonna head over to Mia and we'll see you what, once we finish riding her. I'm sorry, I couldn't help myself. We decided to make a load of sexual references throughout this video. Maybe that's why it's got four dislikes. So we just come off me as riding adventure. Um, that was quite good. Quite good. Um, not as intense as the one I've done. I've done many other ones like this, but um, some random kid pointed at me and shouted "vlogger." Don't get me wrong, I like it when people do that, but it, it slightly annoys me as well. Yeah. Um, <laughs> we have um, the yeah. dragon up next, don't we? The dragon. Yeah, we're gonna go do yeah. the dragon. Probably the one. Probably the most hyped attraction here today. Opinions on Mia? Yeah, it was lit. I don't know what I just did my camera. Yeah, it was lit. I liked it. So the microphone was on. <laughs> right, but the funny thing about this, let me explain. So Dylan at the time, he had a mic, and he had to turn it on every time he. Was going to record. 
but every so often he'd forget to turn the mic on. And it was absolutely hilarious because when Dylan forgot to turn the mic on and he realised he didn't turn the mic on, he does faces like this. And it was absolutely hilarious. And that's what made the road trip funny is because a lot of the time Dylan kept forgetting to turn the um, mic on. <laughs> it's, not as, it's not as good as Cobra. Yeah. It's not as good as Edge at Poulton's. Edge at Poulton's is brilliant. Anyone who's done Edge at Poulton's, you will know how brilliant that, um, I think it's a Zamperla uh, disco coaster. Why is it called a, a coaster when it's not a coaster? But it's not well, that's because it's got a hump in the middle. So well, we're definitely not doing that thing. You like humps, don't you? I did. Huh? You like why? I watched this bit, which was when we went on Viking River Splash, and this is how we're going to end the video. It was the most hilarious water ride experience I've had. Just watch, and you'll see why. Thanks for telling me before I've even done it. It's good, it's good. I like the experience before I could do it. This reminds me of the do or die soundtrack. I really, really do It was like really upbeat. It was like the do or die soundtrack. It was. I have heard they have all the effects working. So yeah, you're going to get drenched there. I hear. You're going to get drenched at the end of the effect. I'm going to do my um, best can, no worries, right? <laughs> no, we'll have to do some sort of thing. Am I doing my thumbs up? Here we go. Here we go. We were getting thrown all over the place. My elbow fucking hurt after doing this ride. Camera, here we go. Boys, camera, let's go. If I didn't get in that, I'll be so scared. Oh! Quite a rough ride. Right. It is good though. It hurts my back a little bit. It hurts. They haven't even got the effects on, I don't think. No, they don't. But they used to work quite. I really, really enjoyed it. It kills a bit of time as well. Yeah, We're not going to be at the Dragon, which is a really sick coaster. And Kim. Ah! <laughs> Zach got absolutely <laughs> soaked. We were cracking up. <laughs> We were in Ow. stitches. Yeah. Ow. Ow. Yeah. <laughs> I hit my fucking elbow. Oh, I love this ride. But the only bad thing about Chessie's uh, Legoland even is they close all of their water rides at dark to help with safety issues. But I can understand that future being a fan. What is oh. it? Here we go. <laughs> Dylan just started screaming his head off. It was funny. But yeah. We are going to end the video here. Thank you everyone for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please hit the subscribe button. Go subscribe to Life of Dills, Jack Silkstone. Um, yeah, just go subscribe to Jack Silkstone and Life of Dills. Their content is brilliant and they deserve everything, every bit of support. So yeah. Thank you very much, guys. I'll see you guys. Also, go subscribe to King Mark stream as well. Sorry, I almost forgot to say. Anyway, see you guys in the next video. Peace out.